Unlike some people, I was of the impression that Critico was actually a very fun MMO. I played the Thai version of it, or at least I think it was the Thai version of it before Enmas ever released the game globally. I was absolutely gutted when I learned earlier this year that Enmas were actually shutting the game down after a brief two year run only. I know, I know, Critica is a hub based MMO, so it lacks the appeal of MMOs with more frequent, more diversified content such as Final Fantasy XIV or Guild Wars 2, but I felt like it was an abrupt closure. It wasn't as well received or as popular as Soul Worker, probably its most direct competition, but it had a loyal player base nevertheless. But all of that is changing as All M, the South Korean developer of the MMO, is actually planning on self-publishing the game over here. That's right, the game may have been shut down due to and Mass's poor handling of the title, but for fans of the game, and let's be honest here, yes, there might not be that many of us, but that doesn't mean that we don't exist it looks like we'll finally have the ability to carry on playing. Critica never shut down nor ceased development in South Korea, and with the developer self-publishing their own game, that might mean that we get faster, more up-to-date versions of the game concurrently with their South Korean releases. But then again, I still have PTSD from the last time an MMO from South Korea decided to self-publish their game over here. Yeah, although I'd hate to admit it. This does feel a little reminiscent of Bless Online. Now, I'm not going to completely shut down the possibility that this could turn out to be a sincere relaunch of the game. I've just, I guess, you know, been shat on by so many companies recently that I just can't help but be pessimistic. On October 22nd, All M made an announcement on the official Critica Facebook page. Allow me to read aloud exactly what was mentioned. Hello everyone, this is GM Ruka from All M. Sadly, Critica NA slash EU service has been shut down last April. Last few months, we All M have been working hard to bringing the Critica service back and it will be soon relaunching in this coming November. We call it Critica Reboot. This coming Critica Reboot has two main differences from the past service. First, First, there is no stamina system, hence no penalty even after consuming all of the given stamina. Second, reworks of reward structures. Not all, but most of the gears and equipment are tradable now, and most of the items can be obtained through actual game content. More to be followed, so stay tuned. To our past and future players, we've prepared a little gift as our appreciation. We'll be giving out some items when we reach certain Facebook page like counts. And then, of course, there are the rewards listed for liking their Facebook page. Please like our page and spread the news. While details of exactly what we can expect are a little vague, we can safely gather that the game is going to be titled Critica Reboot and is going to be doing away with the stamina system and reworking rewards. Removal of the stamina is, in my opinion, a very good move, as stamina in any MMO, Closers, Soul Worker, Critica, is a terrible design flaw that I think should not exist in any capacity. Limiting what you can do by anything other than your own time invested should never be how you prevent people from running content. Critica Reboot will be launching November 2019. Well, relaunching. Kind, kind of relaunching? Uh, the new version will be going live, but as noted, not much has been revealed. Whether or not they'll opt to have players purchase Founders Packs to get early access or a head start, whether or not the game will be free to play, Right now, there are just too many unknowns to really guesstimate accurately. So, all we have to go off of is that the game is coming back, there will be some necessary changes made, and hope that it isn't going to be a cash grab like Bless was. I feel like that's realistically all we can hope for. But that's just my opinion, my first impression of this situation. What do you guys think? Are you looking forward to it coming back? Does it look exciting? Will you try it out again, or do you even want to? Let me know in the comments below, and let's talk about it. Anyway guys, that is it for me. Thanks for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to subscribe for more content like this, and I'll see you all next time. Peace. Dance,